हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम अगेन दिस इज माय न्यू प्रोजेक्ट ऑनलाइन बेकरी शॉप आई एम यूजिंग लेटेस्ट पीएचपी वर्जन एट एंड द माई स्कूल वर्जन इज आल्सो एट दिस इज अ बूट स्ट्रैप थीम सो वी हैव यूज्ड द विजुअल स्टूडियो कोड आईडी आल्सो सो दिस टेक्नोलॉजी स्टैक वी हैव यूज फॉर डेवलपमेंट दिस प्रोजेक्ट दिस इज अ मोबाइल रिस्पॉन्सिव प्रोजेक्ट दिस इज अ मोबाइल वर्जन ऑफ वेबसाइट so this is all of the mobile version you can see okay now let's start the functionality of the project our project title is online bakery shop we have developed this project with two different type of interface that is the front end face and the second one is admin interface both are totally different interface but both are responsive we are using bootstrap latest version this is a major project from this project you can learn a lot of things man how can you create the database how can you manage the database php with crud application like a create update and delete many of things you can learn so now let's start the features of project that we have developed inside this project okay now this is a home page now this is a home page and now this is a category you can check like a you click on the cat you can check the products related to the cake it's a totally dynamic page all the products are coming from the database related to cake category okay this is a search header bar you can search anything from here so this is a home page if you click on that you can check all the slider has been changed we have added three images for sliders so you can check home page all categories all products which you have into added into the database all products are coming from the database now this is a sliders in some times it will be slide you can say it's sliding so we have added the sliders here we try to make this project more functional more operational we have used a lot of plugins to develop this project this is a about us page project you can see here this is a totally static page this is a products page and this is a dynamic page all of the products are coming from the database if you click on view button you can see here the details this is a all of the products detail so this is a all of the categories so we have added eight categories but this is a dynamic you can add number of categories related to bakery from the database from the admin panel we have separate admin panel for that if you click on the categories like uh, cake cake contains six products sorry four products if you click on butter scotch on view details you can see all the details about the butter scotch cake 
this is a registration page here user can log in this is a con contact us page this is a totally static page this is nothing dynamic but this is a real map a small map i have integrated here so now let's buy some products like uh, some cakes if you can add number of items like click on products if you need banana bread you can add number of item from here like a 1 2 3 which we you want to buy so we have added two items and add to cart click on the add to cart so there is a registration without logging you can't buy the products so you must have the user account on this portal for buying any cakes or a, like a bakery product without account you can't buy any bakery product so the user id is amit@gmail.com and the password so now login this is a user dashboard first we buy the some biscuits like uh, click on the view details after that add the number of biscuits like this view details you can add after that add the numbers of product click on the add to cart two items added into the cart and you can see two items and total amounts gets calculating automatically and the total amount that much 1600 like need to pay after click on the proceed to checkout you will be able to see payment page this is a dummy page not a real payment page you can enter anything like a card number name of card like a master card anything expiry date now click on the make payment but your payment has been done and this is the order summary you can see your order from this you can see your order from my order page you can see this is a great dashboard of user account you can see if user placed total orders 21 confirmed order 21 if you want to click on the details of any order just click on the i icons so you can see the order details so again coming on the dashboard so this is a dashboard page you can see all of the order details and them you can see the important links here either you can go on the page from this or either clicking on this page like all products you can 
go from there. This is a my account page. Here user can easily update his details. This is a change password page. Here user can update his account password. So this is all about the front end thing. And one last thing I want to tell you, this is a session driven. You can see this is a ad administration option is showing, logout option is and dashboard option showing. If I log out, you can, you can see menu has been changed because of the session driven. So the system is checking who is logging and accordingly so that upper menu displaying. So this is all about the front end panel. What we have developed in this project. Now comes on the admin panel. For admin panel, you need to open first admin. Slash admin. This is a admin login page. You can't access the internal page. So the admin user is admin at the rate gmail.com and the password is text. This is a very attractive and great dashboard we have created for the admin panel. Here you can see the total orders total delivered orders, confirmed orders. So you can see everything from here. So this is a dashboard. Even this is a drag and drop thing. You, If you can minimize it from here, you can do easily. This is a quick menu. This is a quick menu. From here, you can go on the page. You can see this is a menu. This is a menu. If you click here, menu will be height like this. So this is the view of the page after hiding the menu. But if you don't want to hide, so this is a main option. So now click on the product management. Comes on the add to product. This is a product management page. You can see all of the products. Also we have added from the database. This is a pagination here. You can see there is a basic pagination. Admin, admin can add a new product from here. Like a name, category, you can click on cost, descriptions, images and save the data from here. And if you click on the edit, of this product will be open in the edit format. Then you can see edit. Now this is a product report page. You can see the products report. You can see this, exp this report export this whole data in C. CSV as well as Excel as well as PDF. You can do disable or enable columns from it like this column visibility. Like a name you can see. 
if you click then name will be come so this is the power of table this is the power of table now same of same for the category here admin can add a new category and here admin can edit the category and this will be open in edit format this is a category report page you can you can export this report in csv x as well as excel as well as pdf you can check here this is a order management order is confirmed you will be able to see all of the orders you can see there is a pagination it's working perfectly click on the view you will be able to see all the details of the order if you want to click if you want uh, if currently order is confirmed but if you want to cancel it just click on the cancel and update here you can see order has been cancelled this is a customer management page here admin can add a new user this is a customer report page you can see all of the customer reports change password here admin can easily update his password now this is a logout page so this is all about the features we have add developed inside the project if you want any type of enhancement you just put it into the comment box we help we will develop the new project according to your requirements so please don't forget subscribe our channel thank you thank you for the watching the video thank you thank you very